we're starting our day in the coldest city in the world right before sunrise and we are heading to the city beach no you didn't mishear me we are heading to the beach on a hot summer day this way the Baywatch will be standing and making sure that everyone on the city's beach stays safe but today we're heading for a nice plunge Alona is already running now because she cannot wait to go into the water but she's scared to do it without a head walrus okay I'm actually thinking Wow, Yukut is so awesome <laughs> and uh, makes me think maybe we should move here. What do you think, Anton? Well, I think you're one of the type of people who are saying, oh, <laughs> I can see myself living here actually. We're almost there. It seems like the first roaruses are about to get submerged into the water. Доброе утро. Антон, приятно познакомиться. Алена, очень приятно. Здравствуйте. Здравствуйте. Все здесь моржи или, или тоже зрители есть? Моржи, Только моржи, да, 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 все моржи. Да, конечно, да, да, да. да. Попробуем, да. Ну, уже лето, не интересно. Да, не интересно уже. Лето уже. Да. Я хотел показать умение, там 10 минут буду сидеть, но на войсках еще... Термометр здесь есть. А, вот! Термометр. Вверх поднимайте. Ага. О-о-о-о! Какая температура? Almost so 40. Минус 36 или сколько это? Вау! Я, actually, не могу сказать, но это almost... Minus 40, and uh, the people saying that the temperature here is colder than in the city. Russian, Russian. Ah, Russian, Russian. I'm yeah. Russian. Yeah. I'm a vlog on English. My name is Nick Vasilyev. Today I am living in city Yakutsk. The most coldest yeah. city in the world. In city. This is what we're going to do to start our day. The head walruses, the senior walruses, are opening up the hole in, in the ice are going to dip and by the way they were very quick to tell me that this temperature minus 36 celsius and i'm going to write how much fahrenheit it's already summer i was planning to impress them with my five minutes stay in the ice hole but it turns out it's nothing impressive here they're saying it's basically summer you came too late before anyone even gets into the water, they have to clean the ice which starts forming on top. And this is regardless of this uh, big wood on board and this blanket that the cars are covered with. No, сейчас практически лето, поэтому не надо замерзать. Это Наташа или это Диао? Наташа. Наташа да. Даже Наташа не помогает здесь. There's no Natasha saving the water from freezing in these temperatures here, oh, especially overnight. Maybe it got to minus 40 Celsius. But to them it's nothing. And we have the first walruses of the day. Get into the water. I am Dirk Lisse. I'm going to soon take a And the Peterson School, 98 years old. And the Gregorson Institute. Super. Потом пойдем в снег. Хорошо. Эх, пьем снег. Аккуратно. Обязательно нужно рукавички, да, шапку? Ну да, он... Голова, чтобы быстро не замерзла. Ага. Матушка земля! Вот так мы... Целуем матушку землю. Любим. Антон вышел. 
Покажите ему мастер-класс. Честно скажу, даже внутри садежи было слишком холодно. Николай уже второй раз, он уже в снегу искупался. Да. Вот сейчас начинается самая-самая иглотерапия. Все тело покалывает, да? После О, вот этого. Очень сильно. Не стесняйся. Дом вешай. Дом вешай. Можем зайти. По крайней мере, сейчас очень сделали тепло. Ого, ну, не, нормально, нормально, как суп. Это... Даже первый раз для меня иглотерапия. Тоже нырял с Да. Там, в Марнауле? На Байкале он. На Байкале. Это уже иглотерапия для меня. Заходи, заходи. И резиновые они. Вот такие надо. Так, такие нет? Давай снег. Снег? Снег. И вот нет, снег. Нет, снег. Да, да, а, нельзя, да? Опасно, опасно все. все. Завтра будем лучше а подготовить. Давай, мы завтра еще подготовимся. Тогда. А -а -а. А вот такие С легким паром. Да, да, да. С легким паром. Как ты чувствуешь? Я чувствую, что это был первый. А, акупунктур. Да, да, да. Температура минус 36, да? Практически 40. Да, ну, практически 40 отжимания тогда надо. А вы не купаетесь? А я сейчас пойду. Да, пойдет. Сейчас пойду. Пока снимаем. Пори. Давай, молодец, фори. Ложу сейчас вода уже. Все, иди, иди, как переодевайся. Супа, давай, надо. А, э, покататься? Давай, давай, лицом, и нужно поцеловать лицом. землю. This is my turn. Let's go into minus 40 degree uh, ice bath. So I'm chilling here with my one chai. Wow. I don't know it's too inside. <laughs> I feel incredible coming off the tropics <laughs> doing this in minus 40. Wow there. Uh, Just the energy. <laughs> top, 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 top. <laughs> Before we continue. What? Before we continue, I'm just having a quick breakfast here with uh, quintessential br Russian breakfast with, with kefir and these uh, berries. Looks I'm not sure how, how they're called. Ball. These maroshka berries. Mm -hmm. I need to see how they're called in English right now. And But they are incredible. very popular here and uh, very popular and very rare. And very expensive. And, yeah, and very expensive. Yeah, twenty-seven dollars per kilogram. All right, just got off the private helicopter, and now the second most popular method of transportation after helicopters in uh, remote Siberia. In a place like this, with the cold like this, but you cannot help yourself but feel like you run this city, you run this place. Actually, there are three main methods of transportation here. The first was the helicopter. The second is a snowmobile, dragging our seat, and the third one. Whoo! This is the best ride I've ever been on, and I've been on quite a few rides. I can easily envision my life with me and my seven plus one more, because I'm life path eight. Me and my eight Siberian Huskies, storming the Siberian frontiers, deep into the unknown. They're getting tired. <sighs> Carrying a big unit like me. Big up the Siberian army of huskies 
and a positive inspiration, a motivational person. Woo! Let's go, baby. Don't mind me, just having a phone call. <laughs> Working hard, yeah. <laughs> that's that's the best job in the world. Going in front of the slide <laughs> when Anton was here. It was incredible. Wow, oh, so nice. <laughs> oh, Anton. This is the most. Oh, look at this. Привет, 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 привет! It's a real wolf right here. So they gave us two bands, and uh, this is the Yakutian tradition. We are going to tie it up, making a wish, tie it up to this tree. made a wish. Okay. I hung it on a tree and it's gonna come true. I'll let you know when it does. May this come true. I really, really want this. No, it's a tea time. Спасибо. Якутия растет. Розендрон. Розендрон. И по булочке это конфеты. This is the experience of the year, maybe of my lifetime. <laughs> it's a, truly, truly is. It's just incredible seeing these dogs and being in the forest. And uh, the weather is amazing. When you come to the forest, you need to leave something. Yeah, leaving a coin and uh, making another wish, which is going to come true this year. Unfortunately, all good things have to come to an end. We're heading home soon, back to the restaurant where we'll enjoy some traditional Yakutian food. I'll miss you, my friends. <laughs> There's some turns. <laughs> I'm falling, baby. Everyone is falling. We ain't falling the first time. We ain't falling anytime. We're going downhill. That's why two of us at the same time. I took a luxury seat. <laughs> On the real I took a luxury seat. Oh. My man is working. Yeah. Working hard. Yeah, that's why I'm the postal inspiration and motivating person. I need to lead my girls by example. These are my dogs. <laughs> oh. I'm a professional baby. Everyone is falling the first time. We haven't fallen so far. I don't plan on falling. Look at this. It's not stopping the dogs. I guess I'm walking home. <laughs> This was fun. Cool experience. Incredible dogs. It's been an absolute pleasure going on this ride in Chuchur, Chuchur Muran. Ah, such an experience to like even it, yeah. pull out of the sled. Yeah, yeah. yeah tell me about it. <laughs> when I fell off, it was so funny. But this is experience of a lifetime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. we well, experience of a of a daytime because maybe we're coming back in a couple of days. <laughs> Just too good.
I already imprinted into myself this uh, image of Yakutian girl. So I just want to have this. <laughs> uh, you want to be Yakutian now? <laughs> yeah. You want to culturally appropriate like this? <laughs> or culturally? We don't culturally appropriate here. We culturally appreciate the incredible culture <laughs> of the northern people. After surviving the toxic without falling even once, I declare myself the king of Chuchur Muran. I want to capture all the territories. <laughs> That's a queen, but make no mistake. It's a patriarchy kingdom, monarchy. I hereby declare myself the king of Chuchur Muran. Soon coming after all of Yakutia, all of Siberia, and all of the north shall be mine. But for now, just this little kingdom here, Chuchur Muran. <laughs> I have the red carpet rolled out for the royalties. <sighs> Roy Jones Jr. was here. So he's the second best boxer to come here after your true. It's a cool experience for him as well to come to the same place that I've been to. So we're starting with uh, the first appetizers, which are called the treatment of cheese can. And the only cans back in the day could uh, regularly treat themselves with uh, delicacies like these. So first we have false young horse, young Yakutian horse's uh, liver. And then we have this uh, fat petroleum, and then we have a mix of everything in this uh, sausage. And you have to eat it raw and uh, frozen. They're just just take with hands. Okay, take with hands. Yeah. You're right. How's the liver? This is the first time for me trying horse meat. No, it's actually delicious, yeah. On a platter of <coughs> big bone platter. It's like sausage and uh, it's called blood sausage. But uh, for some reason it's not uh, red, it's white. I'm going to uh, give it. <laughs> this one I try. Okay, yeah, so yeah, then, then, then try. I'm not going try. today. I'm not going to do it. Is it like Chewy soft, or what? soft mm -hmm. and liquid, liquidish? Oh, yeah. This one is definitely. It looks like a jelly. Yeah. It tastes like candy as well. Oh, oh it's my really gosh. good. Yeah. It's really good. Smell. I know. Yeah, it's really good. No, oh, it's really good. <coughs> I'm serious. It's really tasty. No, I cannot try. Hmm? I cannot try it. Why? Okay, I will try it. Oh, it's really good. I just eat it all, yeah. I need to eat with onions there. I'm not going to finish finish uh, how but then. I'll just eat it all. quite something, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, again, if you're not used to eating. <laughs> oh my... The revolution will not be televised, brother. And then you said you like it? Oh, I don't like that at all. But uh, <laughs> I wanted to suffer as well. <laughs> Incredible place overall. Other than this milk blood. False sausages, which only a fool who will order if you ask me. Now it's time for a little walk, and we're going down there to the Museum of Permafrost. The day is so long, morning ice bath. Riding, I, I wanted to say riding the horses, uh, riding the dog sled, eating the horses. <laughs> No, you didn't eat it, so <laughs> I take all the credit for this. Excuse me, but don't even try to take, take the credit of the of the battle with the milk blood. 
<laughs> sausages, which I am. I hope. I hope. Eating Yakutian sausages. Yeah. And now. Go eat Mickey D's. And now we are on the way to. Permafrost. Yeah, to the. Permafrost. Kingdom, kingdom of permafrost. Permafrost. Not Parma. Parma is in Italy. Frost. Permafrost. It's right here in Yakutia. The land. Permafrost. But there are frost underneath the soil, which so far never melts. Never. Ever. 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 <laughs> ever. As the sun goes down and we are walking through the wilderness of the Russian taiga to find the permafrost museum palace kingdom. Let's go, baby. Let's go, my queen. Of you know what? Cringe. Cringe. <laughs> Welcome to the entrance of the kingdom of permafrost. And the kingdom starts with this cave entrance. Wow. It smells really fresh in here, a little bit like a forest. Watch out! They're watching you. Big brother is always watching in Russia. So they have these icicles hanging on the entire ceiling. People tall like me. Just going to smash through them. <laughs> intentionally, right? Intentionally. In my case, intentionally. It's written here that you cannot touch. Not touching anything with my. Yeah, just this one. Don't break it. Oops. <laughs> to just randomly touch this. So here is the bar. Maybe we can come have a, have a drink. The full bottles are inside of the ice. And these ones maybe they also used to be full. Table and ice bar. Hello, Anton. Hello. Give me one shot of the kilo, please. <laughs> Not giving you any shots, like we don't do interception. <laughs> <laughs> so all of the all of the booze obviously is gone. Long gone. Alona keeps following me, so we're doing th these blockception maneuvers, trying to escape her. But I'm sure she's going to catch up. So I'm not really fond of these blockceptions where 15 people are talking and pointing the cameras at each other at the same time. And absolutely true, all you need is love. Love, love, love. We can uh, make our wedding here. Yeah. Because okay. all you need is love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is us. We we'll just bring the guests, get them, get them uh, a ticket each. Bring the prince. <laughs> We're done, yeah. Okay, we figured it out. Of yeah, of permafrost. Yeah, here is the coldest hotel room in the world. With the permafrozen clothes, permafrozen pants, the permafrozen cardigan, the permafrozen shirts. Actually, it's barely frozen. The permafrozen belt, the permafrozen dress, the permafrozen suit jacket. Oh my! Oh my! You can look at yourself while in bed, enjoying the beautiful view of your permafrozen hat with icicles on top of it. Are you comfortable? Are you comfortable without me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can Are you really comfortable? Yeah, yeah, you can play Care Careless Whisper. <laughs> Are you comfortable here? Oh, I didn't see you over there. So this, my friends, is where all of the magic happens. Or to be more precise, none of it, because there are probably permafrost cameras <laughs> filming us <laughs> about to kick us out. My dream was uh, to come to this ice hotel. And now, yeah, yeah, yeah. And now you can really get the feel <laughs> of what it feels like. So you can come here, pay five bucks. And get the feel. This is the deity of Bai, Bai and I, with long gray hair, and it's the patron of the hunters. They offer it pancakes and butter and pray to it before going on a hunt, and if they don't, or even some accidents to happen. You can see here the wise old man with the gray hair. For the impure people, and end up here in the lower world, so this one I'm just saying on the outskirts. And these are the symbologies of the lower world, of hell and the world of 
shamanism. So the lower world, this is the middle world. It's populated by humans, animals and birds. I guess this is where we are. And then some people go to the lower world at the end of their journey and others elevate themselves. And this, my friends, in shamanist traditions is the infinite world. And this is how they see the creator of the world. The deity above all deities. Ooh. Can you imagine if it just jumps out like this? Okay, right, bro. Are <laughs> 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 What the? Yeah. What the hell? It's so real, yeah? Is it frozen? Yeah, it's frozen, yeah. Is it I hope real? it's frozen, yeah. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> you want this friend to come in with you? <laughs> yeah, he just Are fell, sure? by the way. He just... Are you sure? He just fell on the ground. So beautiful. <laughs> it feels like it just uh, freshly passed away. Like a deceased person. Once it gets cold like this, sad. Hello. One of my great great grandpas, he was named Kurti, which means a wolf. And here's my me and my here's me and my uh, wolf cousin. Don't mind us, just two awful wolves chilling next to each other. I think it's a wolf because the the head is really big. I haven't seen a wolf in person, but it resembles more of a wolf than a dog. With this massive brain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now look down. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it looks really real, yeah? Yeah, yeah, it looks really yeah, 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 yeah. real. You're a husky nai, you're a husky nai. No, it's a wolf, I think it's a wolf. Look, look, look. Wolf? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Husky nai in solita. I think it's a wolf because look how, how large the, the head is. In the Permafrost Museum, in the spirit of permafan, I'm taking one of these. Woo. Oh, this is quite something. Woo. Is even a sled? I sled. Yeah. Let's go. Woo. Woo. <laughs> oh. Fun in permafrost. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is where the party is at. If you want to come have a party, this is your place. This is the New York of Yakutia, the contemporary concrete jungle. Here with a disco ball. I feel like I'm going to need a permanent visit to the restroom in a bit. So we need to accelerate the permafrost kingdom exploration because it's too cold after the meal. Hello, uh, I'm an India blogger from India, YouTuber, you too? Yes, me too. <laughs> you, which but I'm from Russia. <laughs> Russia, nice, I'm Russian, nice. yeah. Uh, which part of Russia? Uh, I live in Samara, which is uh, south of Moscow, like down. Okay, down. near uh, Caucasus? So uh, no, 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 not so down. <laughs> <laughs> near Kazan. Near Kazan. Kazan, got it. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. yeah. Okay, nice meeting you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, bye. Bye. What's up? I saw it. <laughs> and what's up? What's up? <laughs> now we pick it up? Now we pick it up? Look at this. Wow. This was. <laughs> There's no stop in the dogs. <laughs> They're going wild, baby. <laughs> I told you, but, but imagine how poetic it is. I said they want to listen to the big boss, I'm the new boss, I'm the new king. 
I'm the impulsive inspiration and motivating person. I'm that guy. I am that guy, G. I'm that guy. Look at my jacket, G. Yeah, I'm sitting there. And then. It's like, where is that? It was like, what the hell is happening? And then we go and go and go and go. And then I said, okay, maybe he wanted to walk. And then this guy saw My guy saw it. He's like, blood! Ой, вообще, Я такой, зачем, почему он не сказал стоп? Что надо сказать? Ты смотришь, я сказал... О! 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 О, she! О, she! Мы только что прыгали на эту бич. Это был очень длинный день. Мы взяли напи с Аленой, потому что мы уже молодые люди. Мы закончили завтрак. We had an overload of uh, <laughs> your cuisine, cuisine yeah, especially with the, with the Koba side, which the was incredible, but the inside soup, pat, patraha, yeah? Patraha. Patraha. I mean, I'm, I'm cured forever, I feel like, so I'm so cured. Is this money on the floor? No, I'm not cured of my financial poverty yet, <laughs> but everything else, I'm completely cured. That's why I'm becoming more and more of a local day by day, and I decided to not even get any leggings because they're quite itchy. So just put on a pair of jeans. I'm betting on style over comfort and safety since the bar is just how, how, how long? Like three, four minute walk? Yeah. yeah. So I shall survive. Meters. Yeah, so I mean, it's uh, three minutes if you're running. If you're running, if I'm running, I'll be there no in, in, in less than a minute. I need to check the world records. Maybe I'm going a little bit faster than that, given the weather conditions. I'll have to accelerate a little bit, <laughs> pick up the speed, make sure I get there before before I freeze. Even right now, it feels quite all right. With uh, a single pair of jeans, I'll grab a glass of wine each because we promised. And then I have the place para bakalov, which means para bakalov, yeah. Two glasses. <laughs> two glasses of wine, yeah. Promise to promise, especially when it comes to showing up and drinking wine at your friend's place. And especially tonight, on Saturday night, it's supposed to be popping. And we we'll still need to go tomorrow, 8 a.m. in the morning, back to the beach for a new session. And we'll be checking out. With the Iceman. Yeah, yeah, with the Iceman. With the Russian, with the Russian Iceman. Iceman, yeah, yeah. The true Siberian Iceman. The founder of, uh, of Walrus in, in the coldest city in the world. And then, hopefully, we're going to be heading to one village in the area. So we can show you how life is like in the countryside because this is like the capital of the entire Saha Republic. It's definitely going to be way different in a, in a small village compared to, to the big city life over here. Oh, 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 oh. I definitely recommend this place because the owners are just uh, just made them yesterday for the first time. No no previous notice, nothing, you know, but they're, they're just really kind, genuine people and it's uh, worth coming here for, for them alone. Actually, there's one thing that uh, we're missing so far. Do you know what it is? Of course you don't. Siberian ice cream. This is what people eat all the time. <laughs> Even in the winter, yeah, yeah. People are crazy like this. Yeah, absolutely yeah, why not. Yeah. But you need to eat it outside, not inside. No, no, no. Well, we're going to eat it uh, yeah, so this is an experience of its own, yeah, so we need to eat ice cream outside. I have a better plan. After the ice bath tomorrow, we can have an ice cream. What do you think? Yeah, there is absolutely nobody that's, got, that's sitting out there to sell us <laughs> ice cream. Date in the morning. But it's a great idea, yeah. even only during uh, Soviet times, but even in later years, nobody cares about copyright law. <laughs> so they heavily borrowed from gorillas for this uh, Russian song. Definitely recommend you ending your day at uh, Parabakalov, a couple of glasses of wine. <laughs> Look.
losing my voice. Du, 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 du. Let's go, bus. You missed our bus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. Catch the bus, baby. <laughs> no, we're definitely not running after the bus because my uh, my toes are still hurting a little bit from the morning. I'm not gonna lie, but it is what it is. Thanks for watching. This was one day in the coldest city in the world. And see you next time. Booyah! Do you wanna do something or not? Yes. What? Here? You want to copy me again, yeah? Say something. Else. You want to steal my stick again? I'm going to come over and slap your right and left hook. <laughs>